Welcome back everyone. Good morning and happy Friday. It is 547. Here's your look at weather and traffic on the 7th today. Looking at mostly calm, comfortable conditions into the afternoon time. We are looking at breezy patterns and then those breezy conditions will turn windy by your Friday evening. We're also looking at some moisture potentially pushing into the region, but how will that impact your upcoming weekend? Well, for now today we're looking at warm temperatures, looking at 89 for El Paso, 87 your expected high in Las Cruces. So we're talking about breezy conditions turning windy and you can see with a preview of our 12 hour wind gusts over the next 12 hours and we're not looking at wind gusts getting too strong looking to reach about 20 miles per hour in the afternoon hours about 3 p.m. to 4 p.m. getting close to that 20 mile per hour mark now that is still considered a breeze so overall next few hours looking at those breezy conditions but tonight we're going to start to see those breezes intensify a bit into some stronger winds we are looking at this happening closer to about 10 9 p.m. at least according to this model you start to see that those wind gusts push in from the east and you can see up closer to about 10 p.m. we're starting to see potentially about 32 miles per hour for those wind gusts in El Paso so overall peaking tonight at about 35 miles per hour for those winds that is still on the light side but certainly stronger than what we're going to feel for the morning time now as these winds push in from the east they're also bringing with it some moisture into the region now we are sitting very dry. We are under a severe drought. We're not looking, however, at much out of this uh, moisture that's going to push into the region. We're mostly looking at our eastern counties being impacted. So that would mean Otero, Hudspeth seeing most of that moisture. So this moisture is going to push in from your Friday into your Saturday afternoon. And you can see about Saturday, uh, about noon, we're looking at that moisture near Sierra Blanca, Van Horn region. Now, Paso, Las Cruces, not looking at great rain chances. We do have a slight chance for rain but again, not looking at very strong rain chances. Most of that rain impact is reserved for the eastern counties. Now, that being said as well, that moisture that makes its way to our eastern counties is looking very slight. So heading into your weekend, here's what you can expect. Of course, a lot of graduations happening kicking off tonight at 2 p.m. EPCC has a graduation as well as at 6 p.m. So here's the temperatures you can expect if you're heading out tonight. Again, the winds will start to pick up about 10 p.m. Now for your Saturday UTEP, Having a graduation as well, kicking off at 1, 85 degrees, 87 by 5 p.m. Here's a look now at your seven-day forecast, sponsored by Matches Firm. Mostly comfortable today, breezy, then windy tonight. Some light moisture pushes into our forecast for our Saturday, and then things clear up in time for Mother's Day. Michael?